Hey everyone, ever wonder how people make these cool backgrounds for their WebEx meetings? Stick around for this week's Tech Tip Tuesday. Having a virtual background can help others learn a little bit more about you. In this case, I have my strengths from Strength Finders, as well as my position with the Department of Education. Creating a virtual background is simpler than you think. Head over to Canva.com and set up a sign-in with your DOE K-12 account. Here, you'll see you'll get access to Zoom virtual backgrounds. Although we don't use Zoom, Zoom uses the same dimensions as WebEx, so it's a great place for you to start. You can pick a design, a template here, or a photo for your background, and we're going to drag in some elements here. There are some cool elements that you can drag in, and you're going to click and drag and just drop it. Here, you can grab your text, and there's a lot of cool text that you can put in. We're going to use this kind of professional looking one here. Drag it here, and of course you can edit your text and resize it to fit your needs. You can continue to add and layer things on so you get the look that you're looking for. Then we're going to click download and we're going to save it as a PNG. Once it's downloaded, it'll come down to your computer and you're going to go and open up WebEx. Once you've downloaded your image, you can open up WebEx and start a meeting. You're able to start a meeting without anyone there so you can set your background. We're going to go down to the bottom here and start video. And once your video pulls up, you're going to change the background. Here, you can see there's a little plus sign. So I'm going to go ahead and click plus. And this is going to allow me to add my background. I'm going to head over to my downloads folder where I saved it. Pick up the PNG, tell it to open. And there you have it. It's as simple as that. You'll see that the text is reversed, but it's okay because everyone on the conference call will see it the right way around. Have fun with your new virtual backgrounds. Thanks for tuning in to this week's Tech Tip Tuesday.